Medications hailed as miraculous and helping cosmetic surgeons turn back the clock for patients. But now, those same drugs are performing a far more heartwarming miracle for a little girl who thought that she would never walk. CBS 2's Carolyn Gussoff was there for some of Dina's very first steps. You want to go for a walk with mommy? It's a simple pleasure, a parent and child taking a walk. But until recently, it was impossible for Dina Frank. A year ago, Dina was in a wheelchair. At seven years old, Dina has been taking her first unassisted steps. Born prematurely with brain bleeding, she has cerebral palsy. She never walked on her own, even after a double hip replacement. Okay, I'm going to let go again, okay? We don't really have to take the wheelchair anywhere anymore. It's incredible. The incredible strides are due to a new treatment. Twice a year at New York Presbyterian Morgan Stanley Children's Hospital, Dina gets injections of phenol and Botox. Most people associate Botox with cosmetic procedures, but the same medication that freezes muscles to get rid of wrinkles is also helping children with cerebral palsy to walk. Phenol is alcohol used for chemical peels. Pairing the two, Dr. Hake Young Kim is seeing dramatic results. Ultrasound guides pinpoint injections all over the body that relaxes overly tight muscles. For me to cover more stiff muscles, I have to use the more than one medication. So I start to use two different medications, which allow me to cover more stiff muscles. Two medicines typically used to beautify, now creating a different kind of beauty. Dina can put both feet flat on the ground and walk. That's terrific. It loosens her muscles. Um, it makes her more comfortable. Um, it allows her bones to grow without the muscles getting tight. Dina's parents say the unusual coupling of drugs has been life-changing. As a parent, it's just amazing to see, to be able to, to see your daughter walk out onto the driveway and walk onto the school bus instead of having to be put in a wheelchair and having to be lifted up onto, onto a bus every day is, is a life we couldn't have even imagined a year ago. In Jericho, Long Island, Carolyn Gussoff, CBS 2 News. Good for her. Dina will need injections twice a year and also physical therapy as she continues to grow. The freedom, though, that she must feel oh, now, right? Just tremendous. You can uh, hear it in her mom's voice, too, definitely, right? Definitely, definitely. That is just amazing. All right.